Sometimes people are just too far gone. And I don't want you to reach that point. Far gone. And I want to give you the advice that you need. But I don't want you to become... better. Till it's done. You don't have to. <laughs> no, you're not a bad person, Kyla. You... You really think that you're some... terrible... Unfeeling person? Sometimes you have to be. You have to, so that you can get through the thousand years of your life without getting hurt. Basically. Is that it? That's an empty shell of a life. I'm an empty shell you know of a it. person. It's bullshit. You care. You just won't let yourself. What, you're punishing yourself for some reason. Saying that you don't deserve love, you don't deserve to care for other people because they're just gonna die. And so you're gonna live your entire life unfeeling and uncaring. What kind of life is that? safe one. Not a good one. It's several years too late for life. Can I make do with what I have now. You have a thousand more years left, right? I don't think... And what's it about being too far gone? <laughs> now stop talking about me so think... much. Talking about you. We can talk about this another time, but right now it's... I want to make sure you're okay, alright? You probably don't want to hear what I have to say either. <laughs> Go ahead. No, I don't. I don't know if you're a good idea. Most of your ideas aren't good ideas, Kat. That's nothing new. One spell it. I want to kill Sarah. It's not a good idea. I know. Just... You have to simmer. <sighs> Why did she just get to ruin life? I said it before! Only the people who do terrible things succeed in this world. Well, what are you two doing up here? Escaping from everything out there. I see. Uh. Sorry. Good to see you're alive. Um, Captain Amelia is looking for you, Kyla. Yeah, I know. Couldn't keep waiting. Is there a specific reason? Yeah, it's okay. I'm a, I'll be alright. Nothing to worry about. Oh. Alright. Go ahead. Um, right, I'll leave you to it. I need to go make some deals with some bandits, so I will be back. What? Uh, they have the goal to come up and try and trade. We need food and medicine and... Quite honestly, we need the silver to pay our guard, though. See if you can get my sword back. 
<laughs> no promises. Give Amelia my regards. And grabs your hands. Oh. Thanks, Kyla. Sorry, I can't do more. And that I couldn't do more. You've done more than you ever think. Do exactly what I needed. It's an interesting concept for me. I know. It's I said it. Don't let darkness take purchase in your heart. Shame to see something yeah. so beautiful. Be <laughs> we'll see. I suppose. so soon <laughs> just can't stay away I can forget that when uh, attending a meeting with Amelia mm -hmm. It's hard because Kyla sees Cat going down his same path and he just doesn't want that to fucking happen. But the way he's dealing with it, he doesn't want her to deal with it. His only way to deal with it is cut himself off, which is what he has been doing recently. Seen uh, Captain Amelia? Wait, is that her over there? Never mind. Thank you. Lupus. Oh, Kyla. Uh, sorry. It's getting rather late. <laughs> Silver. Thank you. Anything else you learn from that individual with the sword? No, he tended to just kind of wander around, spend some time in the tavern. That uh, other female was with him most of the night. I'm not sure where he went to I go to sleep, see. though. So he cares for her. Yeah. Good to know. Mm. The individuals, the scuffle beyond... Do you see it? I see guards. Beyond it. Something happened? Oh. Oh, are they bandits? Is that what that is? I want you to trail them back. You want to know the silver? This is how you'll do it. Trail, trail them back, see where exactly where they go. The bandits? Either to the same ruins, if not to the same ruins, then you will tell me otherwise. Captain, good evening. Both of you actually could help me with this. Trail them back and there'll be a silver earth for both of you. 
the bandits that are across the bridge that we are bargaining with for some strange reason. I'm curious. There are, there are torches. I don't know what's going on. And it's bargaining with them. Is it just them? From the know. graveyard, we're seeing torches all about the place. I don't know. Report, night. The deal has gone off as smoothly as it could. They and they have their silver, they have their food. They use rope. They look for any entrance that they have. I grant it. We did not expect such a thing. Guardsmen, here. However, we were able to drive them back with fire. Well, there's extra Shall I take these back to the castle? Okay. Wait for the captain's commands. Very well. You don't get yourselves killed, Captain. Otherwise, we will not be able to do further business. Oh, I guess they're the same to you. Little oh, trash. Say again. I did not hear you. Your name, I did not get it. I'm taking these back to the barracks. Ah, Salah. Give the money to the royal cotton. A pleasure. From Gravia. Um, you give it to Falgra. As you know, I'm Irindal. One of you will accompany and her. I, uh, leave the money on his table. I hope yeah, that I you can. and yours find you know. safe passage. Come along. Wherever you're going. We will not if we take too long. Because once it is dark, it is a death sentence to be outside. So, lead first. I wish you adieu. Good night. Good night. Come what on, boys. Give them? Back to Stowers. Food, <laughs> medicine. Mm. Things we could muster to give. Why are we trading with bandits? Because we need to pay we our guards. Coin. Because without guards, then the bandits come in. I mean, the bandits who are so likely to launch another raid on the castle and take what they please like they did the last time.
they fucking respawn? Captain Melee asks us to. <clears throat> Do they respawn, chat? No? Holy fuck, they took off then. Carrying all those supplies, they bolted. Seeing if they're going back that way. They were heading in that direction though. Also, they fucking bolted with all those supplies on their backs. I don't know how they ran that fast. But we should check the keep to I see if they're we there. Supposed to follow them. Yeah, well, I know they suggest. didn't uh, poof, so I just know they ran though. Let's see if we can find the uh, keep. Sure. Too far. Ow. Mm. This way. We need to get back before nightfall. I don't have to deal with those fucking demon things. Oh shit, I forgot about them. Yeah. Okay. Let's just head this way. If we see them, we see them. If not, we lost them. It's just a silver thing. Exactly. I want to die for a fucking silver. We'll cut up. The future reference is over there. Is it? I think I saw it for a moment. Beyond this hill. Just kidding. Fuck it, let's head back. Wait, this is it here, on the left. That's the keep, I don't see anyone there though. Let's head back. She told us to follow them for a silver, so we did. Better get a fucking silver. spawned at the keep. So we did see them at the keep then? Let me just double check. 
I'm just gonna sprint up and peek. Just ask Brunswick. Just, just, just ask Brunswick. Be like, hey. Yeah. Uh, we went all the way back to the keep and want to know if we were to see any guys there because they all respawned. Hey, one sec. Uh, Bronze got a second. What did you say? Um, Sarah and I were following the bandits. We lost track of them, but we went to the keep to see if they were there. Did you guys just respawn there now? Yeah, we respawned. It's we completely seen them? garrisoned. Okay, cool. Yeah. Thank you. We've seen them on the walls and shit, keeping watch. Fantastic. Yay. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah, they're garrisoning the walls, so they're like completely garrisoned. They're still there. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, we were seeing that. Oh my king, I'm fucking terrified of that. Alright. Okay. <sighs> Rushing. What did Kat say to you? <laughs> a lot. She's just sad and upset and emotional, you know? Fox are killing me. Is that still going on? <sighs> she mentioned it. I advised her against it. Told her to simmer down and don't do anything stupid. Glad you're back. Mm, I need to go report to the captain with Kyla and then I will find you. They're still garrisoning the uh, stronghold there, but they haven't left completely yet. Is this normal with her? Now the dick measuring contest? Cut them off, and no one has anything to compare. Alright, she wants to go back into the forest. Who's the redheaded girl? Redheaded girl. Hey, she was hard. Maybe, maybe for you. I may help, right? You don't mind if one of the men escort you up to go get her, and the rest of you lads stay on there, do you? Not at all. Of course, this is fine. I can go myself if you wish. Oh, right. I don't know. Sergeant, take the man. Of course. Of course. Where did she go? I have a fucking idea. Captain Amelia! Captain! You think she would have been out there? Oh, what, what is that supposed to mean, Surgeon? Well, I'm I mean, I believe I've seen you. There's no Captain Amelia. Time to time, let alone that, when, uh, what, who are you? I don't think I've ever seen you before. Oh, right. You ever you've seen what Captain Amelia is? Ah, the purple one. <laughs> I had no me. bloody idea. It's yeah. Listen, lad, if you're gonna do that, cover the rest of the purple of your face. And... It's more for keeping my hair out of. Uh, the light at night time. It's white. Harder to see when I have the hood on. Your eyes are really fucking bright. It's got a point, you know. I have really fucking bright. A lot of dreams. I'm as bright as this one, sir. Yeah, bright. Mm. Yep. Surgeon, yep. you're right Fuck. there. You might need to see a car back there. I don't know if that's been invented yet, but you should oh, see one. Oh, shit. You're. I think you're a few years ahead of the time. Bro. Have you seen Captain Amelia? Bro. <laughs> I have not. Not recently. Fuck. 
She's so sneaky. Yes. <laughs> it's pathetic, honestly. How's Cat doing? I don't know. Why don't you ask her herself? She's hiding behind the fucking wall. I'm not fucking hiding. I'm keeping an eye on you to make sure you don't kill anyone else I care about. <gasps> Boo! I'm Get over yourself. Oh, Fuck your boyfriend. Coming at the glove. That's just the glove. Oh, we're in now. Oh, that's oh, you, Captain. I've got, you got weird. Now you've seen Captain Amelia around. Your hands are small. Terrifying bad hands. Did you just keep it? Oh, I did. I believe she's in foul grip. Oh, we're going to arm ourselves. Please, wait. What do you need it for? Oh, she sent us a scouting mission. We're reporting back to her. No, 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 no. Yeah, you know, I mean, my feet is huge. I you should know as well. I think it's Jarrah's son. I know. Who's getting like 70 years old? You have a fucking mix up there, Deepa, and old man? No. Good job, man. He can pull me a whole fucking car. So who's arm wrestling? Oh, he's going to the submission. Oh, shut the fuck up! Make me, slut! To God, how is she not been executed in this town? I don't understand. People like to execute people, yet when a slave acts up and everything, I don't understand. Like, that just doesn't make any sense. I just. God, I love people. Here. Oh, good oh, 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 Right, and you did that willingly. Oh shit! Now we don't. Yeah, <laughs> got to trip one of the iron walls, make him look like an idiot. Oh. Fair enough. <laughs> Only in plate that must have hurt. Yeah, it sounded funny. <laughs> um, but yes, I think Amelia's uh, preoccupied. I guess so. I guess we'll see her when she shows up again. I need to speak to Fulgrif anyway. Usually, uh, I need to get it. Mostly, that was funny. <laughs> Why not? You scared? Oh, Bit of comedic scary relief. You scared, bitch? You, you scared? Oh, it's literally it's 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 really looking at me with his fucking beady little no, fucking no. eyes. Could you imagine you okay? being a rabbit? Scared of a rat? I'm out! Sure how <laughs> thought I heard something. Oh, I couldn't have, oh, I I couldn't have imagined being a rabbit very least. No one wants to know what that sounds like, Liz. You'd be surprised. Yeah? You're right, Tinker. Yeah, what he came for? Did I just watch you offer yourself as a stool? Yeah, the guild I got told to a man fall in full plate. We'll be heading back. Oh, oh. oh, oh, it looked to me like you were wanting to be sat on. <laughs> no, the captain, we did a duo. He told we me to get on my without. hands and knees. <laughs> he told the me to get on my hands and knees and then a man fell over me. Good yeah. man. Yeah. 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 There's no fucking dozen in this town. Come on. 
Hello. Do you guys like to go grab something to eat now? I am famished. So I may charge my mouth. Jesus Christ, just go to your fucking house. Stop talking to Your turn with this. Basically <laughs> empty. When the captain yells, it literally hits my funny bone every time. He just kind of drops all, like, persona. Stop talking to me! What the fuck? It's supposed to be... What the fuck? What the fuck? You know, the captain screaming is supposed to be fun. It's supposed to be scary, it's so but it's funny. more funny it's than It sounds like a man on the fucking edge. Can you pick me up? Please. Uh, fuck's sake. It's either that or a gremlin crawl all the way Hold to the back. Hold this. Just impale Sarah's eyeball with that fucking flower. Free. <laughs> That doesn't reopen from this. Come on. The fuck are you looking at, ugly? Move. I was looking at the, the quite nice flower. <laughs> Oi, I think Captain Amelia's look. There's that fucking rat. Yeah, I know hey, Captain Amelia is. Hey! No, you don't. You fucking hate yourself. I know you do. What the fuck? Richard? Oh, wait. Oh, you <laughs> Oh, he said the words. Oh, no. Oh, wait. I wanna see what's going on. Richard's like that other man. Why are there so many fucking. I I threw the sword up in a quarter a little bit higher. You come around here often, Drum. Huh? Come around here often, Drum. What are you doing on these parts? What are you doing, huh? Give me, your, give me your lunch money. I don't have any lunch give money. It was stolen by the money. fucking <laughs> bandits. Give me your, give me your lunch money. No, nah, I don't have any lunch. Please, I just want my chicken nuggies. No, no, I want my yogurt. No, uh, uh, you fucking bullies. You're all bullies. Quick, take his liquor. No, not my liquor. What the fuck is that? Is that just the lunch on the walls now? You're all bullies! I'm drow. telling on you! <laughs> oh, Mr. Drow. <clears throat> That's Dr. Drow to you. Where did they hurt you? I worked hard for my PhD. Do <laughs> I want you to know. God, you don't even know his rank. Hey, I'll see you in the morning, lass. Or a lad. Sorry. Lass! Yeah, Holy fuck. Sorry. Uh, so, I have something I'd like to ask you, Mr. Cohen. Right. Fuck, you know what? Bear said inside. Fuck it. Uh, Morgan, please. It's fine. There you go. <clears throat> How's it hanging? Honestly. Honestly. Things could certainly be better. Mm -hmm. Did you hear what the bandits said? No. They know where the monsters are coming from. Do they? And the monsters, those things in the night. I've been seen going to and from a camp that's also frequented by the men in pointy hats. Really? There is a chance that Tarek might be there. Tarek's... You don't know? I don't know. Um... I was under the impression he was taken out of town. I believe his body was taken out of town, yes. His body was taken out of town. <sighs> and who killed him? Who killed him? What do you think? Inquisitors themselves. Of course.
Oh, that makes so much more sense. I'm sorry, Mogar. You know, I thought there may be hope for Tag yet. Yeah, I don't think Kat even knows he's already dead. I'm pretty sure she's dead. <sighs> yes. Regardless, you should know. There's a camp between here and Dunstead. Dunstead. These things are apparently coming from. Including the men in the pointed hats. Hmm. Interesting. Thanks for letting me know. I just wanted you to be sure. I just wanted you to be aware I was considering whether or not I would even hmm. toss. I thought it would be possible to help the poor boy. I have well, my understanding that he's passed away, unfortunately. Sorry. I'm simply trying to gather a little information to find out who this. The guards are looking for you. Why did you touch the dick? I didn't touch a dick. You touched someone bad. They're mad about it. <laughs> no. Ripped his chest. No. Who could never? I suppose not. Actually, no, I sit like this. Well, There's no way I'm having my back to the fucking door. Upon, yep. So I suppose I shall return to it. <sighs> Thank you. Roll the 21 on it. <laughs> nice. Nice, tasty. Look at that. Jesus Christ. When yeah, do I get to drink? Yeah, brace the sun. I want to drink more. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is going on? What's that? What? Why are they all coming in with their arms up? No. Uh, I'm so confused. I don't know. Did you notice that? Two in a row came in with their fucking arms straight up in the air. It's bizarre, anyway. I don't have a last name. Huh. I don't properly have any name, really. Saravith, I made my song. Donaloth is what they call me in the Underdark. It means from darkness. Is there a reason you don't call yourself that? No, no, no just because it is a title that was given to He's me. Already missed they last I am call and so have you. I am called Saravith the Cursed. Donaloth. Some people ordered a lot of hmm. wine. At that table there, and then they got so drunk that they left. Now do I want to make a joke and not? That's the real question here. The big one. No one's stopping you. He's gonna take it. I mean, it does seem to be the real. Yes, I'm sorry. Here you go. Does seem to be a reoccurring theme, doesn't it? And maybe a bit of truth rings to it now. What with you know. Booga booga. Ah, we lost the friend. Oh, you shouldn't have been looking for me. Booga booga. Can you say that? Booga booga. I don't know. Ooh, I'm going to drop you off the top of the prison tower. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> right. I haven't thought about her all day, actually. Where's the common house? Chat roll, do Good. We've been rather busy, so I can understand why not. I paid for a bench, and I intend to stay upon this bench. Right, how much is a bench? The man of the bench, bench man. Want some lad? Bench man. I'm okay for now. Maybe later. Benchman, Benchman. Oh? Oh. Oh. Thank you. Well, lads, take a bench and it's yours for the night. 
suppose if there's any place to pick a bad habit, uh, Ledford would be one of them. Hmm? Nothing. <laughs> Picking up. Oh, uh, all right. That's fair. That's fair. Miss Teresa, good night to both of you. Turning in now. There is that sort of air about Ledford today, isn't there? Tired. A form of dread. But then again, when doesn't there dread in Ledford? Oh, Ooh, excuse me. Dreadford. Mm. Dread, uh, when is the not. <laughs> I'm writing that one down right now. Dreadford. We've got Dumbstead and Dreadford. I Dreadford like makes it. makes me want to fucking die. Take this, please. Ah. Yeah, you pour that into your neck. Well, I mean, as of uh, oh. tomorrow, I oh, suppose I'll be a. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm going to go in your mouth. Feels good on my skin. Not... Obviously not. It's going to get sticky. I think he knows sticky. what he's doing. I think he knows I'm what he's doing. Sticky, Kate. You stick to your Mr. books. All right. Always sticky. Always it's sticky. Fucking nasty. <laughs> You are Do in you no position to talk hands? about nasty. Of course I wash my hands. What? Openly talking about pissing on people. So? It's not nasty, it's piss. <laughs> everyone does it, Cade. <sighs> yeah, Cade. Wait, everyone pees on people? Do you pee on people? Yeah. You don't? Get a load of this guy. Fucking moron. Right. Right, you know, you, you can piss on each other all you want. I won't, I won't say anything about it. That, that can be your thing. You, you want to join next time? No. You could save you a, a bottle or something if you want. I am right fine, actually. A mason jar. <laughs> so it stays fresh. I had a lot of errands too. Aged. 12 years. Drow piss. Good vintage. Good vintage. Good vintage. This is so cursed. Less. <sighs> That's the name of the people brand, actually. People are into all sorts That's of... Oh, is that what we're going to do? Yeah, people are into all sorts of things. <laughs> we could start up a... Um, I'm not sure if we caught a scam. We sell bottles of magical drought piss. It does have magical oh, qualities. Oh, 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 witchcraft. Miracle elixir. It'll do the trick so fantastic. <sighs> If you drink the urine of a drought, we'll help you see in the dark. <sighs> that and plenty of carrots. Sorry, I'm not good at. Oh, is that why your eyes are orange? You even so many carrots. I had to kill And it helps out your eyesight. It was forced I'm just to have carrots. Tinted orange. Yeah, pick her up and bring her and sit her back in. Let her have some, some, some social interaction. Come on, bestie. Yeah. Come on. Come on, Xavier, work those muscles. You want to be a big, strong swordsman, right? Back at my home, I was a whiner. I guess I could have Okay, you can look at him, she doesn't mind. Ooh, a woman always needs her weapon on her. Who knows what's lurking out in the darkness waiting to kill you? Thank you. <laughs> Oh, uh, Slides the plate over to her. Or at least he was. It is rather Thank you. Have late, some so twenty-one row meat. I paid for that, and you're offering. You know, never Excuse mind. He is, uh, hey, you're not <laughs> fucking eating it. Well, yeah, because I was I was offering to some of you two. I already had my share. I think bastille has <laughs> been through enough, and she I deserves a good meal. <laughs> don't you? <laughs> not arguing with that. When I, saw you this hmm. morning, I asked for a meal, and the guards just gave me an one. The gods are fucking stupid. You should stop relying on them for anything. Hmm. Well, there's yes, no one else comes right. to visit. And that, that's not the right answer you all this. You need to get you, like, a car or something. Chandler, you say. I, um, I'm hiring the, uh... 
Performant. I'm gonna make me uh, something called a real tag. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, that's not a real chair. I guess it's pretty self-explanatory. No. That seems like it would I believe work. Mr. Morgan no, had that idea. It. No, 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 Once one when his did. legs were broken. Mm. Mm. So they never completed mm. it then. You two have a wonderful night. Mm. Lad, if I may so give I you a word of advice. Mm. Your, mm. From every conversation I have heard from you today, your mother... <laughs> uh, Xavier, would you like to sit with us? Kind of screwed up. Oh. Yeah, take a seat, lad. I think I'll be, uh, oh, I think it'll be fine sitting over here. Do we? Infirmary will be closed for the night. I'm heading off to do my sleepy duties. You all have a wonderful rest of your Her duties. Her duties. He said duties. He said duties. How are you recovering from your run? Good night. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> Like How are you recovering from your bone? Uh, scar tissue is coming in, it's getting tight. I'm trying to, trying to stretch it out, but my leg's never going to be the same. I'm sorry. Sometimes gets ideas that it happens. Maybe not the best. But, uh, but, uh, I, I I've gotten know. more scars in the past few weeks and months than I have in my entire life. I don't want to start a grand collection, so hopefully I stop getting them soon. I understand, but it's not like we can be... All the roads are closed, are they? Oh, um... I doubt these lashings on my back and scars as well. Would you, um... I usually Early in the morning, feel confident when I'm doing would you help me commemorate Terry? Uh, good Were you not there for that? I know she, that no, she I wasn't. Would what about him? Right now, now she, I, don't know I can do that. Can I commemorate a murderer? Me to, um, Why? Learn I can understand Fjall. Fighting and, uh, I don't know. I just... You need... In a time as dangerous as this is, you may wish to I take gave her him a second chance. But I think she wants me to be yeah. like in the tales. I think Psycho what he's Psycho. trying to say is that he may have been a murderer over in the Most Empire, in but here he was a different man. The exceptional he wanted to help people. Many Do not run from your mistakes, Vistia. No of, one can. Simply dead. Eventually I they catch up. He wants to come on the good side of the not the bad. But she you mean the ideas. fake side? Well, um, the side he fabricated to make sure he was safe here, away from his captors. You're a good man, Xavier. Ironic. People like Tarek. We're lucky to have you have you as a friend. Start making candles, and I can. Be rid of this. Let me know when you're ready to get that and new it's sword. Time that I started living She's gonna take three silver out of her pocket, time. slide them across the table. No, I think can. No. That's why I've been uh, going around and right. speaking Morgrim's to Fiery so two point oh. tradesmen today. I want to see you and using I'm helping it. With the, helping with building the fort so I can get a little That's more. That's if I stop being scared for Let's go to All things happen with time and practice and exposure. Mm. Hopefully this has taught you a lesson on who to trust. I am in the same boat, though I have been gainfully... Yeah. Regardless of if they're good or not. You want to brew... Do be careful, Kyla. You want to brew for yourself? Sure. You want to start your own brewing business, you mean? You mean? I wish to restart the not to care too much about here. who is good or not. I believe that the... His pupils are dilated to shit. See, that's holding a blade in his hand. Very familiar blade. What's that? It's Tarek's sword sword. Say again. Sure. 
The blaze made of steel, according to Hing. I'm sure he would have wanted you to have it. Steel, huh? Okay. Thank you, Jack. I'm gonna go to waste. Right. Try not to hold tonight. <sighs> Don't mention Back. What? Get inside. How old are you? Get the fuck inside it's now. Those things again, isn't it? Fuck me. Yeah. Together. Um. So those things are back. What? Those demon things are back. Oh, for fuck's what? sake! Oh. What the <sighs> the I don't know, everyone was just running from the fucking palisade. Ah. Great. Uh, Xavier, would you be a DM? Take that sword and just like... Let's see how this goes. Get within the gates. People are in the tavern They're still. Coming. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Tend to the men! They Make sure they're, they're in position! Alright, you fox. Yeah, Two of you down here, the rest up on the wall. Wait, is Arnon's inside or is your side? I have no idea. Up on the wall, go. I'm ready. I recommend you get some torches and put them on the wall. Yeah, go do that. Ah, shit. Stop. Drow, hold the line. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Uh, yep. Come on, I do. Get on the gate and get yeah, ready yeah. to pull it. Got it? Okay, very well. Take it easy, lad. Time to test out that crossbow. 
it's still working, so fuck me. Uh -huh. I don't have a. I'm just gonna grab one of these. And Crossbow. Yeah, it looks like a crossbow to me. <laughs> yeah, let's get up there. I need to do something in my own head for a second. Okay, one second. Ah, oh, chat, I need to urinate. That is <laughs> so fucking bad. <laughs> Hang tight. I'm gonna go check the, uh... Place for some real quick. Alright, we're back. <clears throat> Sorry about that, chat. Unnecessary evil. Um, what? <laughs> it has the sword? Tang. Actually, never mind. Cat. Did Tang give you Tarek's short sword? Tang. Is this Tarek's sh short sword? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Mistake was made. I'd be standing near Tang. He doesn't have a limitation. It's fine. We'll roll with it. Ah, huh, good to know. Whatever this demon is. I'm sorry. Oi! Get down from there! I know they can see from We can see further than you can, we can let you know when they're coming. You're not allowed up on the wall. Do you wanna know when they're approaching or not? <laughs> I try and even be can I have one of you. 
I need one of you on this side and one of you on the other if you're going to be up here and help. I'll slide over. <laughs> sure. Stay safe. These fucking torches. Tell me, Kyla, what are those drow eyes see? They're taking the dwarves to Dunstead. Taking the dwarves to Dunstead? I mean, no, I don't see anything. Sorry. Ah, okay. Oh, I don't have a torch either, Captain. A blood moon rises. Fetch me their souls. Have it mean the astral? When you can see in the dark, do you mean perfectly or just better than us? As if it's daytime. Oh, almost perfect. In fact, shit. <clears throat> I almost thought you were a bandit. Oh. Who goes there? Tis I. Oh, it's just you. Yeah. Hello. Hello.
anything. Nope. Jack shit. Well, scream loudly if you see anything, huh? Okay, loud isn't really my thing, though. Well, make noise so we know that you're being murdered by the scary things in the dark. Can I go? <laughs> I mean, if I can't hear you doing that and come try to help you, then I mean. I do it really loud, like. <laughs> as long as I can hear you when I'm walking by. That's okay, the that's the signal. It'll be our secret signal. Don't tell anyone else. Okay. Wait. wait. What if one of them things makes that noise too? They won't make that noise. Okay. Okay. You, you, yeah. Yeah. They won't make that noise. I doubt it. Okay. If they do, then they're really smart. <laughs> now you're giving me doubt if you're doubting it. Then I'm not doubt. Well, no. Look. Okay. 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 How about I go and then you go. And then if I return with. Hang on. I see them. Up there on the tall hill. They're gone now. Captain! Oh, the, uh, blue. Hi. I see them stalking around on the hills outside the palisade. On the right hand side's calling for you. They hear something, or they see something. Regroup with the other drone. Roger. What's going on? Whoever that is. Moving up to the palisade. Can't see them past the wall. <clears throat> Did Lauren feel bad? I mean, no, Tarek, uh, like, Maple DM'd it, so that's the canon one we're going for. It's fine. It's all good. I already have a fucking sword. I was like, what am I going to do with two swords now? Like, I guess I do wield. <laughs> no, it's, it's poetic that she gets the sword. Tell her not to worry.
Actually, now that I think about it, that's probably really fucked up, because basically what that was was Kyla going to Kat, being like, do you have Tarek's short, short sword? And she's like, yeah. And Kyla being like, a mistake was made. <laughs> that probably is really bad. Now I feel bad. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't. I just realized that. <laughs> I'll have to talk to her after uh, after the episode to clarify. Should I could get up there? Sallying out. That's poetic. It's good because she's going on like her uh her darkened route. You know? And she has Terek's sword to do it. <clears throat> oh god, what if she kills Sarah with Terek's sword? Fuck. Wouldn't be that easy, obviously, but <laughs> You only go to work on scuff. Seen a few of them darting around the woods outside the palisade. Only shadows, nothing too intense, but that's it. Oh, now I wish you hadn't said anything. Oh, that was a lie. You're fine. There's nothing out there. Everything is safe. Don't worry. All right, thank you. You guys are your fucking ships. <laughs> Thing is, Cat and Anna are the only people I mean, keeping Kyla. Up these walls, maybe we should like, I don't know, stick glass bits to them. You know? I Using think I read what? That. They did that in a book once. How would we stick them to the wall? I don't know, like, maybe, like, you know, it's snowy out and you just stick them into the wall. I don't it's know, they didn't explain nearly it. winter. Oh. It is nearly winter, so... Eh, hey, winter's coming. Winter is coming. Eh. Eh. Soon you know what they say cardigan with winter. I do. What's you pointing at me for? Oh, I could really okay. go for a pumpkin spice yeah. right now. Oh. I think we'd open up a, a Starbucks in Lead. <laughs> What's a Starbucks? Don't worry, shush. Is, it, is that a tea shop? Yeah, sure. Alright. Get Don't back to watching them dart around the bushes and shit. Does lower and ship Cat and Kyla? <laughs> I honestly haven't really thought about too many ships, in honesty. I just let you guys have your fun. I don't want to, like, push anything. Yeah. <laughs> I see. I'll, I'll take my pants off and stand here. Like that. Come at me, demons! What is Arn doing? God, damn it. I'm jumping down. If the captain needs me, tell him I'm outside the walls. Oh, 
Captain. Hmm. A uh, recommendation has been made to have the militia patrol the palisade with torches to make sure that the things do not climb or fall. Sound like fruits, does it sound like men? Men don't sit. Men. You thought that standing in one place, those things have a crack shot with those javelins. <clears throat> Split people up into pairs. Get everyone at least one torch and have them patrol the palisade on the inside. Right. I asked <sighs> Madame Delta Rally the. Well, I'm sure they should be getting <clears throat> together now. If they're so afraid of light as you say, then perhaps seeing it move back and forth so close to the wall will give them pause. Maybe. I have a question. Let's go on. What are you doing up here without armor or swords and injured? Keep an eye on that game. Not much else I can do that's helpful. Except see one of the fuckers come through and scream real loud like. And then have them run up here and attack you? <coughs> <coughs> the job of a scout isn't a glamorous one. I'm aware. Captain Amelia had a... Right, I'm here. Pulled inside to protect the, uh, the keep walls. What do you mean the keep walls? There's people sleeping in their fucking huts out here. Villagers, people I don't know. like you and me. Apparently those They've got the... That's the word from the captain. <sighs> should I remind him of the villagers who are still out here? Or should we try to wake everyone up and yeah. pull them inside? Remind him that there are people sleeping in their huts and that there's women and oh. that there's implied fucking children. The fuck can say that to God, Captain. He's been pulled in a few different directions. <sighs> uh, so. He's got his duty to his people, but also to the people in charge, like Fulgrith. Can't always protect his Respect. people because Fulgrith will well, punish him for it. And he can't always do what Fulgrith wants because well, the people he's sworn to protect will resent him, right? <laughs> I wouldn't want to be in his position. It's a political type, bro. <sighs> Worst kind of thing to have to be stuck upon. You're telling me. Well, I hope they listen. One of the most important things a militia can do is be made to look bigger than it really is. You split people up into bears. Give them torches at night, especially when you're guarding a castle that's under siege and you don't have enough manpower. You take men, put them in groups of two, give them torches and spread them the fuck out along your wall. It'll look like far more men are there. If these things are a fear to fire, 
and seeing torchlight going back and forth all within the inside it's of my pants. Give them pause. One of them sneaking around. I see its shadow, but that's it. Just past the camp. Can't see a fucking thing, it's too dark. <laughs> Mirandel! The palisade needs to be patrolled. I know. I spoke to the captain about it. He's supposed to be having guardsmen hop on it. I have not seen them yet. Stop waiting for the guardsmen. Get the militia together, Yarman. <sighs> Alright. We have to make it look like it's manned. No worries. I'm not even sure we can kill these things, Arm. How do you fight that? I'm not... <clears throat> I have no idea. I've never been face to face with what you're talking about. I don't <sighs> even know what it looks like. Cloaked, hooded, wear these fucking masks. Uh, they run around on all fours sometimes. Oh. What? Militia is still pulling back. Apparently the guards are the ones who are going to be patrolling the palisade. The militia is to hold the keep. How fucking ass backwards is that? I don't know. But those are orders. I mean, hey, I'm not the complaining. Place, I mean, you know, if, if these things show up, these things show up to the guards, not us. Well, uh, and then when the guards are dead, then what? Well, then that's what we're on the walls for, I suppose. Well, so you're saying we should be the ones told to be left out morning, here to be slaughtered as opposed to them. I'm saying that we're supposed to be out here, nimbly patrolling instead of these idiots clanking about in their armor. Moving back and forth, make it look like there's more of us than there really are. I will confer with the captain again. I have no authority, Kato. Don't worry about it. What? Nothing. <sighs> it's all fucking frustrating. Um. As I was saying, cloaked figures wear these fucking <clears throat> weird ass masks and they run around on their hands and feet sometimes. All fours. It quite honestly terrifying. Your legs all right. You just kind of fall asleep sometimes and I have to like go. <laughs> Look at these idiots. Two men, two torches, by themselves. Not even pressed against the wall. Did say to pair up. One torch per group of men, so they can cast shadows. If you've got a torch on either side of a man, you're not going to cast two shadows, now are you? Mm. See what those fuckers are doing? That's the right thing. The one's closer to us. Hmm. Like time. <clears throat> we have a torch up here in case they show up. We could at least alert people. Um, well, do we even have a torch up here? I don't know, it might help us and we can alert people. We see them. No, because I don't know if these things can see. On! Hmm? Yes? The, uh, vigilance is notable and appreciated, but the captain prefers to have the backup. Uh, the militia surveys backup, only called upon when absolutely necessary, as opposed to risking their lives to protect the, uh, palisades over the guard okay, who are paid to do so. That's what's been referred to me. Cade. Yeah, that's my name. How many guardsmen have died since these things appeared in Ledford? Many have died. Give me an approximate 30, number. More. I say at 30, least... 30, uh, maybe more. Yep. 
Do you think that the fact that 30 guards were killed by, what was I told, four, five of them? Do you think the militia is absolutely necessary? Go convince the captain the militia is absolutely necessary. We have to have a number right now, lad. And if someone wanted to sneak in, all that ground down there is far too covered. Good people just use the cover. listen. It's spread out amongst the palisade. You make it look like there are far more than there really are. You don't have to be actually able to hold it. You need to make them think they can't take it. If they don't think like humans. They obviously do. And why do they run on all fours and growl and... Is there something physically about them that's not fucking human? But their tactics are <clears throat> very human. You don't think they can see, you mentioned? Not sure. That's why I'm sitting up here to see if I fucking die. Ideally, I, I would not like you to do that. Me neither. But here I am. Okay, well, I'm glad we're in agreement. Look at that. Just outside the torchlight, bumbling idiots just talking. <clears throat> mm. 